Hello guys, this video will have a short introduction to one of our ebooks. Implementing a traffic light controller using a PLC. First, we'll see an overview of the project. Then it will be implemented to see its performance. Finally, we'll have an overview of the prepared ebook. Before we get started with today's video, I just wanted to inform you about all the great content we have been releasing on the PLC Goods YouTube channel which includes industrial automation PLC programming, HMI, and microcontroller-based developments. My name is Syed Reza, and if you enjoy this video, I would appreciate it if you could click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell, to receive the latest and the greatest content, I will be posting through the channel. Alright, let's start. The purpose of this video, is to show you the functionality, of our traffic light control system, using a Siemens Somatic S7300 PLC. The Project Overview The hardware part for this project, is a model of four-way junction traffic light. The control program is developed, for a main street, south-north, with four intersections, four east-west streets to control their traffic lights. On locations, where each secondary east-west road, intersects the main one, I have two traffic light boxes, each with three light indicators, and a one, two digits countdown meter. Thus, the purpose of the project, is to control all these timers, and traffic lights, all in harmony. In addition, to application software, such as Somatic WinCC, and PM Designer HMI software programs, were used to enable the control system, to utilize a PC monitor, and a 7-inch LCD display, as system HMI display devices. Well, my name is Syed Reza, and I want to explain another interesting project, the automated traffic light control system. As you can see, this simplified system, consists of four intersections, each intersection has a countdown timer. This direction is considered the South North Street, as the main street, and these are our four different intersections. Each intersection has a traffic light, which has red, yellow, and green LED indicators, and also a countdown timer. Also, this system has a panel, showing the time and date. Now, the panel is showing the current time, it's 18, 43 minutes, and 45 seconds. Also, it automatically shows its date. Well, this is the control panel of the system, and it also has three push buttons, and one switch. When you want to start the system, at the beginning, just push this start button. To stop the system, this stop button must be pressed, and the yellow push button can be used to go to emergency mode and the whole system can be turned on off by the switch. As you can see, now the system is in normal mode, timers and traffic lights are working. Now let me press the emergency push button. When the emergency push button is pressed, timers won't display time, and all yellow LEDs of the South North Street, and also all red LEDs related to East West Street start blinking. We are also able to monitor the traffic lights. Here, you can see all four intersections. As you see, the green light is on at the first intersection related to the main street, and the red light of the first east-west street is on. At the bottom of the designed HMI, you can see, three buttons, which work like the start, stop, and emergency push buttons. Let me use the stop button. Now, let me start the system again. Also, I can switch to emergency mode. Also, when a car is passing between two IR sensors, which were installed along the main street, the designed HMI shows the car speed here. Right now, let me use my hand, and pass it from the first sensor to the second one.
All right, as you can see, the calculated speed is 120 kilometers. Like the main panel, the current time and date are showing on the designed HMI2. Now, it shows the current time. Now it's about 18 hours, 53 minutes, and 33 seconds. After a little time, the HMI displays its date automatically. As I mentioned before, a Siemens Somatic S7, 300 PLC has been used, as the main controller. This PLC can be programmed by Step 7 software of Siemens company. All LEDs, sensors, push buttons, and also this HMI, are connected to my PLC. Also, a similar screen like the HMI, has been designed on the computer, using WinCC software. Similarly, you can see the main street and its four intersections. Traffic lights, and related timers. Start, stop, and emergency buttons. The car speed, and also the current time and date. This title, which has prepared in four chapters, and 134 pages, details the generation of code, for the traffic control system. All main control program solutions, are prepared in latter language, in this manual are written for, Siemens Somatic S7300 PLC. Chapter 1 provides, the schematic of all of the hardware, used in this project, are fully explained. Chapter 2 provides the explanation, of all control ladder programs, developed for this project. All control software related to the project, come with the purchase of the project ebook, and you will not need to develop any extra PLC control program, for any part of the project. Chapter 3 explains how to integrate, both an LCD HMI panel, and a PC monitor device to this project, utilizing PM Designer, and Somatic WinCC software respectively. Chapter 4 shows the reader, how to develop an HMI application, with Siemens Somatic WinCC software. Thanks for watching my content, if you have any question on this topic make sure you leave them in the comment section below, and if you can spend a few seconds of your time liking as well as sharing this video, if you enjoyed it, that will mean a lot to me. If you have any suggestions for the channel such as what kind of hardware or software I should be covering, then make sure to leave that in the comment section. See you next time. Bye bye.